So over here you can see that I have a cube and if I were to select this then you can see that on the bottom you have some keyframes right here. That is because I added an animation right here. But you might add in different animations over here. So let's say for example if I were to rotate this out on the other side then you can see that I have the same keyframes applied right here. But let's say for different type of uh, animation I want to distinguish it visually by adding in a different look to uh, the keyframes. So in order to do that I can right click on a keyframe that I want and I can go around onto a keyframe type that I want to display. So over here instead of keyframe if I were to say breakdown then you can see that visually the keyframe for uh, that particular um, particular area is different. So you can see that I can visually distinguish the keyframes out now with color. You can also go around right here and then select this and select different type of keyframes right here like moving field right here. So let's say you want to uh, like work around with moving keyframes right here. You can select that out. You can go for extreme which enlarges the keyframe out right here or you can go for jitter keyframes as you can see. So these just visually distinguish uh, the uh, keyframes among each other and has no other uh, technical uh, ch changes to the animation itself. And that is how you can work around with keyframe types and then change the outlook of the keyframe inside of Blender. So if you guys learn something as always, and as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.